Hey guys, uh, welcome to Mondays with Kyler. Um, yeah, I'm a few days late, obviously. Um, it's just been crazy hectic, and I am apologizing to all of you and all my brothers on Ambiguity because it's just been crazy hectic. Um, real quick, I, um, I think I said in the last video that I started a new job, um, and that's been great. They've been working me like crazy, and, um, it's just really cool. Like, I'm not complaining. Like, I love my job, and, uh, it's all good, and, uh, I couldn't ask for anything more, but I'm putting in, like, 10, 11, 12-hour days, so by the time, like, I come home, I'm, like, really, really tired, and, like, I normally just have enough strength to get up the stairs and crawl into the shower and then drag myself to bed. Um, it's really crazy, and, um, that's what I'm doing, so... That's that. And another update, your brother here, finally after four and a half years, can no longer say that he's pre-T. I have my first shot on Monday, so welcome guys. I'm on T, and I'm not pre-T no more, so it's like the best feeling in the world. And um, it was a long time coming, and I absolutely love it. Um, I'm trying to figure something out with my laptop, or I may have to get a new one or something. Two, um... <clears throat> work on my own like personal profile but um I'm updating everybody on here because I haven't been able to get on my uh, original profile for me um, so I'm just letting you all know um, it's pretty cool so uh, check that shit out um, <laughs> I'm just kidding but um on to um, this week's topic um, it is if you know you had or have kids um, how would you go about teaching them about gender? Um, you know, I don't really think it like it's, you know, like the gender, um, really that I would, you know, really teach them. I would just, you know, teach my kids to, you know, be respectful and, um, just don't walk up and ask like the stupid questions like people do today, um, or kids do today. Uh, it's just, it's really retarded. Like there isn't, you know, one specific gender for everybody, obviously, because there's males, there's females, there's however you want to identify. So there isn't just, like, one gender, and it's it's really hard to try to, you know, explain that to kids because they're young and they don't really know. And then once they get to that teenage age or whatever, you know, it's, then they become, like, disrespectful and they don't care and they're going to do everything in their power to, like disrespect and hurt you and like bring you down and stuff like that and that's just not that's not cool so I mean I'd pretty much you know you know me and my girlfriend have a daughter um so I'm I don't know like I have a feeling like I want to just you know bring her up to respect people and don't just like go up to random people and be like hey are you a boy are you a girl who are you like I know sometimes like you can't you know like you know, control it because kids are going to say what kids are going to say. But to know that you can, you know, teach them um, that, you know, just be respectful. And um, when they get to the age where they can understand gender and they start learning about gender and stuff like that, you know, it just gets to the point where it's just, um, you can't just walk up to somebody and be like, are you a boy? Are you a girl? You know, respectfully, just, you know... If you can't tell, you know, if they're male or female, use they, them. You know, it's respectful and, I don't know, like, I just, I don't think it's that hard to understand and stuff like that. But coming from a kid's perspective, it's just, it's going to be a little harder. Um, so I just hope, you know, I can, you know, help teach uh, my daughter about, um, all these things, and uh, maybe one day, you know, me and her will have this conversation about me, but who knows? I mean, she calls me Kyler right now, so I can't complain, like, or ask for anything more from her. She's two years old, and she's absolutely adorable. But, um, <laughs> I just, like, my big thing is I'm going to teach my kids respect. Whether if I have one kid, two kids, ten kids, whatever, I'm going to teach my kids respect. And knowing that I can teach them and do the best that I can or do the best that we can with me and my girlfriend. If we do our best, 
and know that we've done our best, then we have no regrets. So, I don't know, that kind of led to a whole different, like, uh, area. <laughs> um, I don't know, I'm just, like, totally big on respect, and I've said that word a lot of times in this video already. Um, but that's, you know, how about that I would go about it. I mean, they're obviously, eventually, they're going to have questions, and then I'll do my best to answer them to the best of my abilities and stuff like that, but I'm just going to, um, you know, do my best, and I'm sure together as a team, me and my girlfriend, we'll do our best together to, you know, teach and do what we can. But um, I know you're watching this, babe, so I love you, and uh, we will see each other soon. But keep your heads up, guys, and um, stay strong, and go visit. 0.5 cc and get this awesome cool hat and all the other apparel that they have dog tags t-shirts sweatshirts sweatpants bow ties whatever you want go shop their supports trans stealth healthy and do it up but um i will catch you guys next week and i will definitely try to post on monday so i plan apologize and i will catch you guys next week bye